Okay, so get this right. We've got Beyonce headlining the halftime show for the Ravens versus Texans game on Christmas Day. And it's all streamed live on Netflix. Whoa. I know, right? Ah. It's like someone took all the good things and threw them in a blender. Talk about an unexpected Christmas gift. Seriously. Like, Beyonce in her hometown Houston, maybe even debuting songs from her country album, you know, Cowboy Carter. Oh man, can you imagine? Right. Plus, there's all this buzz about potential surprise guests. Dolly Parton? Maybe. <laughs> Willie Nelson? Yeah, I can't even... It's gonna be wild. I mean, Christmas Day, global streaming on Netflix, they're really going all out. Yeah, this is way more than just a football game. Exactly. That's what's so fascinating about all of this, which is why we're doing a deep dive today on, well, all of it, the whole crazy scenario. Our source is an article called um, Beyonce Football Netflix, the most unexpected Christmas gift of the year. Catchy title. Right. So let's unpack this thing. Why is this such a big deal? What are the implications for, well, everyone involved? You know, Beyonce, Netflix, the fans, the whole entertainment industry, what do you think? Well, first off, for Beyonce, this is huge. Think about it. Cowboy Carter, her whole country music thing, it kind of got mixed reviews, right? Yeah, some people loved it, some were like, huh. Exactly, so what better platform to like shut down the haters and show everyone how versatile she is than a Christmas Day halftime show? in her hometown. Talk about a power move. Right, and then the guest appearances. Like, Dolly Parton, come on, that would be legendary. And if Willie Nelson shows up, forget it. This could be one of those like career-defining moments for her. I mean, she's already iconic. But... And this could take it to a whole other level. Yeah, totally. And it's so interesting that she chose this platform, of all things, to debut Cowboy Carter material. Right, like why not just a regular concert tour? Exactly. But here's the thing, right? This isn't just about Beyonce. Netflix is right in the spotlight here too. They've been making a big push into live sports streaming. Huge push. Yeah, and this halftime show, it's their biggest test yet. Remember when they tried to stream that Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson fight? Oh yeah. It was a mess, right? <gasps> like buffering, lagging, the whole nine yards, and people were not happy. Especially considering it was pay-per-view. Yeah, that did not go well. So now they've got Beyonce on Christmas day with millions of people watching worldwide, including the Bayhive. Who are, let's be honest, not known for their patience when it comes to technical difficulties. Exactly. Netflix has got to deliver a flawless experience this time. If they don't, it could be a disaster. No kidding. This is make or break for them. They're trying to become the go-to for live entertainment, right? Sports, concerts, everything. But to do that, they need the technology to work seamlessly at scale. So what are we talking about here? Like, What are the technical challenges they're facing? I mean, think about it. Millions of people all over the world trying to stream the same thing at the same time. That's a ton of bandwidth, right? And they need the infrastructure to handle it. They can't have any outages, no buffering, no lag. What about latency? You know, like the delay between what's happening live and what people are seeing on their screens. That's huge too, especially for a live event like this. People want to feel like they're right there in the stadium. So if they pull it off. It's a game changer. It shows they can handle the big leagues. And then maybe we start seeing more major sporting events on Netflix. The Super Bowl, even. Maybe. But if they fail, it's back to the drawing board. And potentially a big hit to their reputation. Definitely. This is a defining moment for them. It's crazy how much is riding on this one event. Not just for Netflix and Beyonce, but for the whole future of live entertainment. No doubt. I mean, it really makes you think, Will they be able to pull it off? Will this be their big breakthrough in live streaming? Yeah. Or will they stumble and leave everyone disappointed? Well, one thing's for sure. It's going to be an unforgettable Christmas day. Either way. You know what? You're right. Win or lose, this is going to be a moment in entertainment history. Yeah. The repercussions of this are going to be felt for years to come. This deep dive has really given us a lot to think about. For sure. It's amazing how one single event can bring together so many cultural and technological trends. It really is. Well, I know I'll be glued to my screen on Christmas Day. How about you? Wouldn't miss it for the world. Me neither. This could be good.